Hi, you guys. This is Prophetess of Phil Sabrina Acapo, and I am back again via the leading of the Holy Spirit with another prophetic word for you guys. And as with any prophetic word, you would absolutely want to go to the Lord in prayer, testing the Spirit to affirm and confirm that perhaps this prophetic word is for you. And Holy Spirit, I invite you in to take full charge, to take full control, to take full access. I decrease as you increase. Allow me to bring forth your word with your glory, with your power, with your grace, with your mercy, telling your story so your name can be glorified for the winning of souls. To the gospel of Jesus Christ and Jesus Christ mighty name that I do pray. Amen, 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 and amen. Tell you guys of this prophetic word is your haters are about to watch you elevate. Your haters are about to watch you elevate. And so on yesterday, you guys, during intercessory prayer, I heard the Holy Spirit say, your haters are about to watch you elevate. And I'm saying to myself, Holy Spirit, I don't want to bring this forth and the Holy Spirit let me blatantly know it's not about what you want. It's about walking in obedience and doing what I told you to do so you can eat the good of the land and the land of the living. Holy Spirit further is saying they are about to watch you feast and eat. The Lord is saying the very ones that were after your downfall is getting front row ticket VIP seats to watch your lifting and just like heaven did with Mordecai. They are about to experience a dose of their own medicine because the Lord has flipped all that was done to you around and now they are going through it. Because the Lord, and this is in no way to boast or anything, because the Lord had already gave so many warnings and this thing was nonstop. So the Lord has said, now his hands are in this as well as his hands being on you. Holy Spirit gave me scripture of Psalms 23 and 5. You prepare a table before me in the presence of my enemies. You anoint my head with oil. My cup overflows. Holy Spirit is saying, feast your eyes on this because you have gone forward as always and you were only minding your business and being about your father's business and this is why I do not want them to miss your momentous moments of increase. Just like Hammond had to go out and honor the very one Mordecai right before his eyes. Holy Spirit is saying that had been the same thing for you. I have done a reversal and some of the ones who have come after you will have to come back and apologize along with honor you, along with putting respect on your name. Esther 6 and 8, let the royal apparel be brought, which the king rideth upon, and the crown royal, which is set upon his head. Mind you, these are things that Hammond was saying. He didn't know it was for Mordecai in 6 and 9. And let this apparel and horse be delivered to the hand of the one of the king's most noble princes, that they may array the man with all whom the king delighteth to honor and bring him on horseback through the street of the city and proclaim before him, Thus shall it be done to the man whom the king delighted to honor. Esther 6 and 10. Then the king said to Haman, Make haste and take the apparel, the horse, as thou hast said, and do so to Mordecai, the few that sitteth at the king's gate. Let nothing fail. 
of all that thou hast spoken. Holy Spirit is saying that had been the same for you. You are getting elevated through royal apparel because your garments are changing. You're a horse. You're getting that lifting. You're getting that elevation. And you are getting your crown because this is your time of that elevation. And all along, he was using your enemies to prepare the royal gates. And it was all along a part of the plan of the Lord to promote you. To cause sustainability. So you will stand and go forth in him coming forth as pure gold. Your haters are about to watch you elevate. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. Don't forget to hit that noti bell where you guys can be notified each time I upload a video. Welcome, 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 welcome to all of my new subscribers, you guys. Welcome to the fam. I pray that this word permeate, absorb, flow, and saturate in your spirit, you were able to get the revelation from these rhema words of exactly what the Lord was saying. And the Lord is saying he is not playing with his remnant, his chosen ones, that he has already gave warning after warning after warning. And it has been a continuation and you were only being about your father's business and mind your business going forth and doing, walking in obedience, doing exactly what he has called, promised, purposed, and predestined for you to do. And the Lord is saying for this, he is rewarding you and he is elevating you. This is your time, your momentous moment to have that crown, to have that uh, horse. Same way Hammond had to do for Mordecai. The Lord has said he's did a reversal of that thing. He's brought about changing and rearranging in your life. So you can go to the next level, your next level of emotion, your next level of elevation. Your haters are about to watch you elevate. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Like, share, and subscribe, you guys. And I love each and every one of you guys. I am constantly praying for each and every one of you guys. May the Lord richly bless each and every one of you guys and see each and every one of you guys through to the greatness of success of God's best knowing that the very trap Hammond set for Mordecai was the very trap that he ended up setting in. The recognition is you are a chosen one and you are on a winning side. And as long as the Lord's hands are on you, he will always see you through. Stay in tune with him, in line with him, and you will not miss nor skip a beat. This is your momentous moment. This is your moment of elevation. And the Lord is saying this is your time of reward. This is your season of meeting everything that is due to you and being some. Your haters are about to watch you elevate. Thus said the spirit of the living God in the mighty name of Jesus. Take care and once again be blessed. I'm praying for you. I love you guys and we will most certainly talk one the next. God bless you. Take care. Bye-bye.